Hi guys, today in this episode, we will try to repair this piece of junk 3D printer from, uh, I don't know what's the company name, but uh, the printer is called Berlin i3. What you say? So not this today? So what we are doing today? Brown box. Ah! Ah, this one. Ah, okay. <laughs> Hi guys, today in this episode, we will play a bit with this each shot dual handle grip for gimbals. The story of this box, you know guys, I ordered this Zhuyin Zhiyun Zhiyun Crane 2 uh, gimbal. I also want to order from them this uh, dual handle grip, but uh, later on I realized they are selling this dual handle grip for 130 euro plus shipment and plus taxes of course. I looked on a market for uh, other solutions and this is what I find for 75 euro including taxes and shipment into the front of my door. I think uh, there is uh, no magic in China, so <laughs> I'm 100% sure this one is total same like what the Zhuyin Zhiyun Zhiyun is using. But this part is absolutely not the same. Uh, what you see here, this is a really sophisticated dual handle grip for gimbas. This section here is much more smarter than the Zhuyin one. Why? Because the Zhuyin Crane 2 dual handle grip is just compatible with the Crane 2 and with nothing else. So if you have tilt a gimbal or I don't know, who is a DJI gimbal or something else, you cannot use this for 130 euro. Eh? It's only good for the Crane 2, but this one is uh, much more freaking smarter. So let me show you. Eh? So uh, you have here this uh, two fastener, I don't know how uh, English people are calling this. When you tidy this up, the inside is going... Because of this, this is fit to many other gears, to many other photography, uh, photographic or video accessories, including uh, pan tilt heads, tripods, light system, whatever. The maximum diameter here, what you can place inside, is about 45 millimeter or 1.8 inch. Yeah, and the minimum is about. 17 millimeter, almost uh, 18 millimeter, 0.7 inch. But uh, <laughs> the smart things are not finishing here. Oh my god. This feature here is nothing more about just the compact packing. Because this one, now it's only about 10 inch long, eh? and like uh, 8 inch wide. Absolutely you can place into your backpack with no issue at all. And look how compact this. Yeah? It's machined really nicely so no burns, no edges, no nothing. And uh, the surface finish is this really nicely uh, anodized black uh, matte half shiny miny. It's really professional looking on the end. If uh, you want to assemble this together, you just have to pull this one to here and then turn this screw in and then turn this other screw in. Okay, so now the middle section is completely fixed to the two road. And I'm telling you guys, I'm, I'm kind of a strong massive guy and I cannot bend this thing at all. And look, look the machining, look, look the details. Oh my god. For, I'm telling you guys, for 77 euro, <laughs> I even will not switch on my CNC or my uh, late 
<laughs> machine for 77 euro. Come on, guys. <clears throat> These Chinese guys, they are unbelievable. By the way, this grip you can install like this or like inverse. You can try. So hold something like this, okay, or hold something like this. In this way, your arm is, it's <laughs> actually is working like a hydraulic uh, dumper. And this rod has some kind of, uh, uh, I don't know what is this, this is some kind of uh, polymer, plastic, with, or with some kind of uh, Teflon feeling, or I don't know what is this. So even without the screw, it's, <laughs> it's really, it's, so it's not flimsy flimsy, yeah, you can see, it's almost fixed, but to be secure, uh, let me put this guy here, tighten up, and so this is the brand, each shot. In the pack you also will find these uh, small puppies. Huh? What is this actually? This one you can mount uh, here to this road, everywhere where you want, and then you have additional three mounting hole where you can install light, microphone, other camera, mobile phone, iPod, whatever, car, motorbike. <laughs> Uh, from that, of course, you get two pieces. Eh? <laughs> nice! But the mounting holes are not finishing here. You also will get four additional, again, 20 UNC or quarter inch mounting hole, which is true also on the other side. Plus, you have also on the bottom of your grip. Okay, so first let me adjust everything to the normal 90 degree, which is absolutely not natural for your body when you are walking or you are, or you are running. Let me show it to you why. Your palm, it has some kind of uh, natural angle, okay, which is this angle. So this is the vertical axis, okay, and your wrist is never be like this, huh? This is really <laughs> a natural position for your wrist, huh? And you even, uh, and by the way, from this point, you cannot go more up. So, if you set up your dual grip system on a way like how your wrist is operating normally, from here, from this angle, you can go down, eh? And you can go up. Like, let's say like uh, 20, degree or something like this. And this is how I always adjust this angle. I just put my wrist in a really resting position. And this one, this surface here has to be uh, absolutely parallel with uh, the floor. Now, this dual handle grip is ready to attach to my gimbal system. It's really straightforward. You just have to open it to the maximum. So loosen up everything here. Okay, so this is Lucy Lucy, and then you just have to push it nice. Ah, by the way, because of this really big uh, adjustment possibilities in the middle section, you can place this one to here, to here, to here, even to here, or even to your leg. Oh, rock solid. Now is the time to open the legs, and then place it like this. So now it's ready for pick up and run. Eh, nah, lock it. Uh, eh, kind of. Okay. I think uh, now we will do here some crazy setup. I think I will mount uh, this magic arm for my phone because this crane too, <laughs> it's it it's just cannot control the, the Sony cameras. It's, it's really weird. Okay, with this application, with the Play Memories Mobile, you can control your Sony A7 family cameras absolutely <laughs> until the last uh, details. Yeah? Put this phone to here and let's check the ergonomics. So now all of my camera setup is holded in my uh, hand and I still can play with my phone, yeah? Uh, you know what, uh, into this one, we will attach a video light.
and now I want to add this action cam like somewhere somewhere like this yeah just to to show my ugly face for you guys <laughs> look at this <laughs> I forgot to add the battery into the camera why Sony cannot run without battery hey Sony connected with the camera yay yeah, it looks to me decent. Yeah. So let me introduce you what kind of crazy camera setup I built with this uh, really nice uh, each shot <laughs> dual handler grip. I have uh, the Sony A7R Mark II camera, a video light, a additional action cam, my phone the dual handle grip and the stand on the Zhuyin Crane 2. As a gratis, I have this really neat uh, remote controller for my um, action cam. And just for the safety, I have also this iPhone uh, Air Buddy with a microphone because I will also record the screen on my iPhone. Let me do some crazy shot with this now. <laughs> Yeah, really nice. I can see myself on my <laughs> Sony watch and I can start the record. Maybe you can see, but not everywhere I have the same amount of light. Yeah, this corner is really dark. Yeah, so it's perfect shot. And because of my wrist is in a really resting position, I can work really freely. For example, I can walk down on my stairs without any issue, I hope. <laughs> Ooh, really, 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 really dangerous movement. Yeah, hi. <laughs> so let's uh, go outside. That is my garden, <laughs> far away. <laughs> so now I will walk normally. And now my rest is in a really resting position. Germans call this Hubwagen. Huh? So now the Hubwagen in the center. And now I will walk around. Ah, maybe if I keep it, yeah. Yeah, I still uh, need to do a lot of practicing with this uh, crane too. But I think, yeah, but I think it's uh, working really nicely. Ah, you finished with the grass? Yes, everything. Very good. nice. Yeah. Now I'm just testing this. Uh... <laughs> Original in the grass. <laughs> Here, bite, bite. Everything. Resentinger. Yeah. Hmm? <laughs> the gardenist <laughs> at the moment. And tomorrow he will do some kind of uh, electrical work in my studio. I don't feel uh, a big pain in my arms and uh, I think I can control this for hours even. Let me do some really crazy movements. Now you can see I shake everything and uh, the system is really well balanced. I really like this uh, dual handle grip from the uh, each shot. Okay, so now I'm not watching any kind of gear, what I have. I'm only watching my steps and I hope the record will be okay. Maybe we will have some kind of autofocus issue because I uh, choose the, the widest open aperture on my lens. Oh, <laughs> I came up uh, to my studio. Guys, I love this uh, dual handle grip. Huh? This was a really big uh, challenge for me to work with this uh, heavy setup uh, down on my uh, stairs <laughs> and come up. And uh, yeah, but I like it uh, at the end. I'm telling you guys this uh, dual handle grip, it's absolutely amazing. Oh, <laughs> I just realized now I installed the uh, reverse, so <laughs> sorry for that. Tomorrow I will upload other uh, really short video about this uh, dual handle grip because I find another kind of uh, application <laughs> with this and uh, this will solve my other big issue uh, around the videography. Yeah? I hope you guys enjoyed. See you next time. Bye.